Did you know in Destiny 2, a small choir managed to tear a planet in half using only their song? The choir was made up of 20 musically gifted hive wizards. The Death Song is a creation of hive wizards to rend, kill and utterly destroy all things both physically and spiritually that hear it. In general, you can tell if a hive wizard is a death singer if they have the prefix Ir in front of their names, like Iranuk, Irhalak and Iryut, the death singer. Although it seems Ir Arok, Ir Yun and Ir Abbasin may be exceptions to this rule. Eventually, the Death Song was weaponized by Eris Morin and the Guardian and became our trusty Deathbringer. It is said that the shadows reached Ir Yut in the Ascendant Realm and learned the Death Song from her. They then reversed it to bring Tolan the Shattered back to life. You've heard Sabathun's song many times, whether you recognized it or not. From Crow humming it in the helm to the title screen of Shadowkeep. Once you hear it, you can never forget it, and Sabathun will hold sway upon you. During the endless night, the people of the tower and of the last city would sing it to deal with the fear that had overcome them. Did you also know Ruinous Effigy, a exotic trace rifle, had the notes from the Beyond Light title music built into the sound of the gun. There's a one in 10 chance of hearing this when you fire the trace rifle. 